Hi, Jim Carefoot at Armada Technologies, and I just want to take a moment in a short video to give you a tip about how to troubleshoot two wire systems. Often, when we're troubleshooting a two wire system, we're required to figure out what's going on with the cable that's out on the ground. So we disconnect from the controller and start troubleshooting for problems with connections, wire damage, other things. Um, in order to do that, we often use a clamp meter. Clamp meter gives us a handy way, without removing any splices, of checking to see if the power is flowing properly in the system. In order to do that, we have to kind of power the cable. And typically, what we have recommended in the past has been to connect an AC based, 120 volt based transformer unit and apply the power to the cable this way. Uh, there's a trick though that we've discovered that allows us to do this without having to have a 120 volt outlet anywhere nearby. If we want to do this testing, we can use a Pro 50 tester from Armada. This puts out a 24 volt test signal and when it's being used in that mode and we can apply power to the cable the same way we did with the AC transformer. Except we don't have to have an AC outlet nearby. This is a very important trick. So. Um, the thing is connected to the wire as normal. We turn the unit on, select 24 volt test, and then I go to on, which turns on 24 volts from the unit. And I'm just going to double check it with this Pro 12. Okay, it's producing 24 volts for me right now. So now I'm going to get out and check the currents. With the 24 volts applied, we're supplying power to the decoders, and the decoders are taking a drink from the line. Um, typical Rainbird turf decoder here consumes about a half a milliamp here, uh, however you're powering it, and uh, in this case, I verified that this does. So now I can carry on with my normal troubleshooting, uh, checking to see if all the decoders are consuming the right amount of power, and I don't have to have a live 124 120 volt outlet nearby.